Winter is obviously very chilling in Kathmandu, starting from December till, I should say, February beginning, and the temperature drops as low as one degree. Rarely goes beyond three degree, and when it is very cloudy, it stays around ten, maximum, minimum, and you can imagine the chill. And these days, because of the unpredictable weather situation, you wonder how things have changed. That's why we go to have uh, these solar units to have a uh, hot water. But the sad part of the story is, uh, if you have to install a solar water heater, then you'll have to find some space in the roof. But if you go by tradition, the houses here are, the traditional houses here have a slope roof and putting a solar in the roof with a tank and so many things is a, is a big headache. Then you may have to find a place which is flat, which is very near to your top water tank and these units always people always try to find that label where the top level of the tank with the vent and your vent of the solar is almost at the same level so it works in a different way then there is always a limitation of putting this solar onto the rooftop and you have a slope roof you have a problem and if you have a flat roof also, the houses are getting small. And as a city gets dense, which we have already seen in town, and people are living in pockets, they're living in apartments, they're living in a two-room units, three-room units, and maybe if they have a balcony, they cannot put a solar, then they'll have to depend on a gas heater. Now this wonderful DIY black pipe solar has an amazing capacity to run without a vent. This, I was aware of this long time back when I were doing this initial experiments because our the solar had to be placed at a first floor and our hot water tank was at the top floor that was almost a gap of 20 feet but fortunately last i think it was yesterday because of the wind this vent pipe got broke and i was about to get one new vent then i decided why don't i do it this way put that stock work and finish it so we did it this morning and we came to know that this solar is doing very well it's the temperature is rising. It was at 74 degree in the morning and stopped working since uh, yesterday as the wind broke. Then I installed this stopcock this morning around 11 a.m. Now at 3 p.m. we checked the temperature and there was a gain of, I think it was, it's 50 degree Fahrenheit gain. So this shows that this, this solar can be placed anywhere. You can keep it in the balcony, you can keep it in the floor, irrespective of, irrespective of your rooftop tank. So this solar is as good as an active solar system where you don't have to maintain that, maintain that scent to the level of your venting and the rooftop tank so i couldn't stop putting it in the tube because maybe many people would want to have it in the garden have it in their balconies so this solar can be put anywhere it's good for the apartments it's good for flatland it's good for slope roof you can Find a place which is flat, just connect it to the system as its own 
and the picture. This winter is already getting over, but still there are a few days where you will still have colder nights, cold morning, still in the hot water sour, try this out soon before the summer starts. Ciao. Bye-bye.